Another important warning this evening, your homeowner's or renter's insurance does not cover floods. You have news, we're still first on the what? scene of breaking news. Oh, and a major accident there. Reporting the stories you want to know and explaining the news in a way you expect. Their first move was to try to... Some move. things oh, never change. For the 24th year oh, in a row, thanks for making us the number one yeah, news in Houston in the morning and at 5, 6, and 10. 13 Eyewitness News, Houston's news leader. Bad weather driving on Eyewitness News tonight. Action 13. David, I'm going to make a lot of mistakes tonight on names, so I hope these folks understand. To me. Thanks, <laughs> Marvin. Thanks, Marvin. Well, before we go this evening, they call it vitamin O, or stabilized oxygen. And two Washington State companies, the Rose Creek Health Products and the Staff of Life, are selling the stuff for more than $10 an ounce. It was advertised in USA Today and other newspapers, but now the Federal Trade Commission is asking a federal judge to bar the companies from making unproven health claims about it. The FTC says the stuff is nothing but bottled salt water. They want the companies to pay the court cost and give refunds to all the customers. And that's Eyewitness News for now. We hope you'll join us again tonight at 10. For Melanie Lawson, Bob Allen, Ed Brandon, and Marvin Zindler, I'm Dave Ward. Thank you for being with us and have a good evening. You've been watching 13 Eyewitness News, Houston's number one 6 p.m. news.